Namaste. My name is Vibhushit Tripathi and uh, in this video I am going to tell you how you can improve your professional communication skills in English. And this is uh, especially for the students or graduates or professionals in science and engineering who are looking to get better business and job opportunities. However, they are struggling because of the lack of communication skills. So let's uh, let's move on to the next slide. For uh, before we go on and discuss uh, the plan to improve the communication skills, let me tell you about who I am and what I do. <clears throat> I'm not an English teacher, just to be clear. But I do have uh, experience in fields where I have used my uh, communication skills in English. I have worked at Barclays and Ayogi. I have dealt with British and American clients. Uh, in fact, I got those jobs just because of my, mostly because of my professional communication skills because I did not have much expertise in IT uh, because my job role was IT advisor and tech specialist. But then. I got selected, I got hired because of my communication skills mostly. Because see, if you do not have the subject expertise, you can still improve that. But uh, your professional communication skills must be uh, at par with the demand. Okay. So um, I mostly, uh, well, let on about my current professional goals. I am a passionate researcher and educator in physics. I run my own physics blog where I take courses and solve uh, doubts, you know, uh, do doubt clearing classes to my students on my physics blog, which is the physicist.in. If you wish to know more about me, you can visit the physicist.in slash about to get my full profile. I currently work with uh, study.com as a solution writer and I have gotten selected in Baiju's and in the first two videos of this series. Uh, for which the playlist link will be in the description. I have explained how I got selected at Baiju's for academic specialist, but then I also told you that um, although my physics knowledge was good enough, uh, in chemistry I did answer all the questions uh, appropriately, but then it wasn't that good um, as physics. But then I got selected because of my communication skills. So uh, that brings us to the second, uh, the next slide where why I'm making this video, okay? The reason is I have realized that a lot of deserving candidates, especially with science background, they wish to pursue research, which is really great. That, that's their passion and I respect it. But then the academic research environment is getting so competitive that most of you would definitely have to switch to industries, okay? So when it comes to industries, your communication skills would be required Okay, they have to be as good as your subject knowledge. Okay, because now that we are entering into a world that is connected via the internet, so online jobs, all the intellectual jobs would be going online. So there wouldn't be any uh, regional or national boundaries for jobs. So English is going to serve as the language of communication and your skills in English would matter a lot. Okay. The STEM students, the science, technology, engineering and mathematics students, they lack uh, in their communication skills mostly because uh, these are the topics for introvert uh, students. Okay, They are introvert students and they spend a lot of time doing, doing their own research in private and deal with machines and stuff like that and equations. So they don't really get chances to interact with people outside their environment uh, that makes their communicate the, the scope for improvement of communication skills very limited okay and that actually hampers their uh, future prospects when it comes to jobs and business opportunities okay because in india english is a foreign language which needs real time conversational practice okay just by reading or studying a book wouldn't help you master the communication skills you need to uh, be in a class that actually is based on conversations where a teacher could uh, point out your mistakes while you do the conversations. That is the actual and the only way to improve the communication skills. Okay. So again, our educational system, the system we have, we have been following for our education and the society that we have, we live in, uh, it fails to provide the proper platform to practice conversational skills in English. Think about it. How many <clears throat> 
how many hours in a day on a typical day you talk in english right most of people most of us don't have even one hour okay and again on my physics videos i've got the received a lot of comments where the students uh, you know they ask me to speak in hindi okay i have never made educational videos on hindi not because my hindi is bad or i hate hindi i i love hindi and my hindi is good enough but then the thing is see if you want to improve then you're going to have to come out of your comfort zone okay so hindi is your comfort zone when it comes to communication skills and you need to get out of it because that's not going to help you in getting global opportunities okay you need to master english so you need to at least try to understand videos in english okay when it comes to uh, you know subject science videos or technology videos okay? and then you also have to start practicing conversations right so what i am going to do because i teach physics okay i i i am an educator in physics i do my own research but then i want to help you uh, guys uh, from science background so that i want to give you the bare minimum boost the way the foundation that will help you uh, with the with the skill the, the model that you need to follow to improve your communication skills so basically i want to give you the right guidance that's why i'm going to decide and uh, no, i have designed a course which i'll uh, talk about where the important message that i have uh, given you is that you need to start working on your english skills right now okay if, especially if you are in science uh, background because you would need a job just like i i need and i have gotten jobs because of my communication skills of course i do have subject knowledge but, but then if you don't have the exact subject knowledge that would be you know that your speaking skills or communication skills can compensate for it but if you don't have the communication skills uh, nobody is going to uh, give you a job okay right so you need to work on your english right now and what is my plan for you say the first and foremost thing is you're going to have to make some investments it's not cost it's investment because you're going to have to buy if you want to quickly improve your english you need to study some grammar first of all that's the foundation of your communication skills so you need to buy three books and if you buy a package it will cost you a total of 600 bucks max to max and the three books are like essential english grammar with answers by raymond murphy then you move on to intermediate english grammar by raymond murphy and then advanced english grammar these are the three books you need to follow one by one these are self study mode books which you can uh, study on your own because every question on each page there is a there is a theory uh, with examples and in the next page you have the uh, exercise questions so the answers are given at the end of the book so you can study these books on your own however if you still have any doubts um, on any section you can uh, always give me a, uh, you know co connect with my whatsapp discussion group and uh, ask your questions there either me or any of the community member will answer your question so that you can easily cover these three books and this is essential okay this is essential this is the bare minimum that you need to work on now the additional thing is if you are ready to invest even more you can join my one month conversation based course uh, which i call rapid so that would be 16 hours of conversations that will also have theories included but not like an english class in a school or or in a college or in the university where you study theory uh, and you then forget after the exams okay this is you will not even feel that we are we are teaching you any theory because it will be integrated into our conversations that we are going to have in the sessions okay now this is the course structure that uh, you will have that like i'll i'll show you that that improving professional communication uh, skills in english that is the goal how is it achieved it's like first you will have an entry level test okay and once you it doesn't matter whether you pass or fail it's just a score that we need to uh, understand where you stand okay and then we move on to theory and conversations at the same time in theory part we'll cover some grammar basically revision of grammar up while you still follow the books on your own a certain part of the books will be included in the course but most of the books have to be covered covered by you we will cover grammar then phonetics uh, dictionary 
will also cover thinking, uh, reading and writing in the theory part. In conversations, we'll have speaking, email, writing and listening. Okay. And then in speaking, we'll have group discussions role playing and mock interviews these mock interviews and role playing will be mostly based on uh, situations where a science student or a professional uh, would basically uh, face situations like interviews and in academic admissions or jobs in publishing companies or teaching as an online educator things like that so we'll practice all all those scenarios and then in conversations you will ha also have email writing how to write emails uh, you know as part of business communications and how to listen properly okay listen to a speaker a lecturer or your student things like that so we'll cover all of it once all of them are covered you will have an exit level test at the end of the month and uh, with the exit level test score you can compare the difference uh, between the entry level test score and the exit level test score right and uh, a little bit uh, more details of the syllabus we're going to cover uh, the two tests that you will have is first they will have mcq questions 15 questions in total and uh, the difficulty levels of questions would be like this like six easy questions six medium and three hard and uh, the total test uh, duration will be one hour okay no negative markings then there'll be grammar in grammar we're gonna cover sentence types and structure parts of speech what, what, what we call then tenses articles pronouns prepositions conjunctions contractions punctuations question tags models and conditionals so there are a lot of uh, topics in grammar which you uh, might have to study if uh, had it been a course in you know, an academic course but since we are going to use the grammar only for our communication skills okay in conversations and uh, uh, business communications we don't have to go into depth of grammar but beyond what we teach in the course if you want to cover then i have given you the links uh, the, the three books that you need to follow the links to the books are uh, given on the website triparties.com okay I am going to give you the link to the website also in the description so you can get all the information regarding the course and the books also now in phonetics we will cover vowels consonants uh, vowels consonants and diphthongs syllables and stress in dictionary we'll learn how to use dictionaries and thesaurus uh, for uh, various purposes such as uh, casual as well as intensive lookups right now in thinking will this is the most important thing that uh, most uh, you know programs on spoken english don't cover the first thing is you what do you normally do for for non native speakers of english what we do is like we think in a native language and then translate it to english now, that actually hampers the uh, the level of communication you need to be able to think in english so that is something very important and we'll learn it in the course okay now in the uh, the rest of the syllabus that is listening in listening will uh, learn how to make most out of uh, to make the most out of listening to active and passive conversations and active conversations is where you are a participant and a passive conversations is conversation is where you are not a participant now then you how to make mental note taking and online note taking during lectures conferences conferences talks debates and meetings uh, we will also discuss about certain good note taking applications okay and then in speaking we'll understand how pauses and intonations uh, need to be articulated we'll also have group discussions role playing and mock interviews based on common stem topics okay uh, like science technology engineering and mathematics topics and uh, scenarios where uh, you would be acting as a researcher a teacher an academic counselor an academic coordinator or business development associate and the reading will understand how to effectively do casual reading and intensive reading as well and writing will learn about email writing and blog post writing and then there will be two assignments of uh, you know two assignments on written uh, writing skills uh, they will be based on shared google docs one for email and one for blog post i'll, I'll, I'll ask you to write an email demo, you know a dummy email and a dummy blog post and uh, you're gonna have to make sure that you are not copying and pasting something and you're doing with proper aco a little bit of aco techniques i'll teach and uh, plagiarism is something that you need to avoid in order to have good scores in the assignments but then 
that is one more important thing if you come up with good uh, you know good communication skills especially in writing i might uh, hire you for my own blog so where you can write a uh, blog post based on science and science com science communication so the the total investment would be again as i said the books are up to you you can buy them from the links that i've given on the website uh, you can buy individual books one by one or you can buy all three of them as a package which will cost you a maximum of 600 bucks or you can actually uh, get it from somewhere if you think someone already has the book or you can get it from a library or a second hand book market whatever method you choose that's that's okay but you need to get the three books one by one you need to study them cover them practice them okay and if you face any issues with them while practicing these three books you can always contact me in the whatsapp group okay now where i'll help you out without any charge however what i'm going to charge you for is the english professional communication skills improvement coaching that i'm going to give you it's a group mode course will be happening on uh, teachment application i will give you i'll be giving you the the demo class link where you can uh, join and see how the course is going to be get a feel of it if you think it's good enough then you can join the price i've set uh, is just 1200 rupees per month because the course is going to last only for one month okay and it's an uh, this is an uh, introductory offer usually such classes uh, are charged at uh, 3500 bucks at least but then um, i want to i do not want, wish to uh, overcharge uh, you guys so if you are interested in joining the course you can join the course at just 1200 bucks per month right now and uh, but yes if you need extra help from my end like special one-to-one -one private sessions then the charge will be 250 rupees per session it doesn't matter if the session is for one hour two hours or three hours but if, if a session has to be booked with me then the charge is going to be 250 rupees per session the reason guys why i'm see there are a lot of free op options you might ask hey, so many f websites and blogs are there to improve communication skills so many channels are working with them and uh, they're all free why should you invest the thing is that if you're still watching this video that means the free options haven't helped you enough right so again there are other institutes which actually charge you for the course and there are good institutes and bad institutes also you are free to choose your options but if you choose my course i guarantee that within one month you will have dramatic improvements and then you can keep on working on your professional skills as long as you want better results and in case of any help you can always you know get back to me on the whatsapp group and uh, the this is all about the course that if you wish to join it join it uh, as soon as possible because as i've discussed in the first two videos about my selection at byju's i have shown you i have shown you that uh, my selection at byju's was not based much on the subject knowledge okay they need subject knowledge but it was more on the communication side okay I, I i answered the questions in physics perfectly but in chemistry I accepted i accepted that i haven't taught chemistry for a very long time so i might not be as good in chemistry as i am in physics but then they still hired me for my communication skills so if you want to take advantage of communication skills i can help you out if you follow what i'm telling you okay so give help me help you out give me a chance to help you out here um, if you think uh, you know paying 1200 bucks for the one month course is too high for you it's okay get the books these three books and start working on them start practicing on them at least for grammar okay at least that will help you out partially but if you want complete uh, improvement then the only way i can help you if you could join my course and take part uh, part in the uh, conversations that i'm gonna conduct in the classes okay uh, you can join the demo batch the link will be in the description and see for yourself so uh, thank you very much for watching the uh, imp all the important links will be added to the description you can go through them carefully you can join that uh, whatsapp discussion group but if you choose to join the demo class then first install and activate the teachment application from google play store as a student not as a teacher or institute admin install and activate the teachment application from the google play store 
and uh, then use the classroom ID given here okay and uh, you can join the demo class or if you want a link after you install and activate the teachment application on your phone or on the laptop go to the teachment website and log in as a student then visit threeparties.com I'll give you the website link where the, there will be an option for you to join the demo class if you just click on that it will automatically submit your request to join the demo class and that's where I can uh, approve your uh, request and you can be a part of the demo class the timings and the brochure of the course will be attached and they're all on the website each and every information is on the website do visit threeparties.com the link will be in the description and thank you very much and I wish you all the best thank you